Hello, Pongo. What are you doing here? Pongo? Huh. <laughs> Hi, everyone. So, good morning. It is uh, still nighttime, actually, uh, but I've woken up very, very early because today is the day that I'm going on my birthday camp out. Thank you, everyone, for making me uh, feel so loved on my birthday. I got so many wonderful birthday wishes. Um, Paige is still over in the bark somewhere, I think. I think she was partying a little bit too hard, but we have Molly here and Stampy and Milk Toast. Uh, and I am, of course, going to start this episode, uh, even though it's a special camping trip, uh, I'm going to start it by heading up to the Dalmatian Plantation and creating another uh, new Dalmatian uh, that we're adding to the 101 Dalmatians. Uh, so today we are going to be adding uh, Dana, and that is because Dana sent me a tweet back in July saying that she was thinking of getting a hedgehog because of me. I can't remember if I said that I wanted a hedgehog, but they're illegal in California. Um, uh, but anyway, she tweeted me again saying that she actually got uh, the hedgehog and she uh, sent a picture of it. And she said she um, she was inspired to get it by, by me. Uh, and she named it uh, Quillo, which I think is a super cute name for a hedgehog. Um, unless the hedgehog is a, a Latin hedgehog, in, in which case I guess his name is Quillo. Uh, but anyway, uh, welcome Dana, little puppy Dana, to the uh, the Dalmatian plantation. So I am actually going to put these cookies back and I'm going to get, uh, oh, <laughs> Moktos and Stampy, they were like, we want to come up, but we're afraid because there are a lot of dogs up there. Uh, I don't blame you. Here, you can sit there and you can sit there because I don't think that cats like to camp. It's just a hunch. I think that cats would be bad at camping. Uh, so I'm going to grab some eggs or just one egg, really, um, a bowl and uh, some sugar. I think that that's all that I need from here. Um, and then I am also going to head down and get some supplies for my camping trip. However, first, I'm going to come and check out uh, the artwork. I got so many awesome drawings from the last episode with my surprise birthday party in the bark. Oh, this is an expectation versus reality of Wink's present that he gave me. <laughs> Um, thank you guys so much for sending all of these. Uh, Wink giving me the throw bone with the drool on it. Uh, everyone in their party hats. Stampy furiously baking his cake. Uh, this one of me getting my lucky pickaxe. And this one of uh, Stampy in the kitchen with Everest and Croissant uh, trying to get some frosting for the cake. Okay. So the first thing that we are going to do is head down here into our supply room and grab... Uh, we actually need some glass... Uh, I think I just need three of those, and um, well, I'll take uh, I'll take half of these, I guess. Uh, and then we're going to also need some gold. Uh, oh, wow! I have a lot of gold. I did not realize that. Uh, and we are going to do a little bit of crafting. As you can see, I have already made a few of our essentials that we will need for our camp out. I have made our tent. And I have also made a grill kit. Uh, but now I'm going to be making uh, a lantern, if I can remember the crafting recipe. Um, a burnt out lantern. That's not good. Oh, that's right. Uh, we need a little piece of glowstone, I believe. Whoops. <laughs> That'd be cool if I could just throw it back into the chest. Uh, I think we just need one piece of glowstone. I'll go ahead and I'll put my gold back. I want to keep my inventory very clean. I'm going to make this into a bottle. Um, and then if I combine the glowstone with the lantern, will it fix it? Yes, it will. Uh, and then also I'm going to use my pocket knife that Everest gave me for my birthday. I'm going to combine that with some logs. And I'm going to get these log seats, uh, which are super cool. I'm going to make... How many should I make? I guess I'll make a bunch. Who knows how many I'll need. Um, and then, am I forgetting anything? I don't think so. I think we can go ahead. Lizzie, do you want to come camping? I don't think that you can keep up, unfortunately. You're kind of a slow squicken. Um, do I have food? I guess, yeah, I guess I have bread. Oh, you know what? I cooked some... Um, I cooked some steak upstairs, but actually, I think, you know, I think we're going to go fishing for food. Uh, okay. Oh, no. Where was that?
that creeper. You know what? I can't even be bothered. I don't want anything to disrupt our camp out. I don't know why this always happens to me. Uh, all right. You know, we'll just fix it when we get home. Okay, that's just what we're going to need to do. Uh, now, look at all the dogs. I couldn't get them all back in their pens uh, very well. Uh, we're going to be taking uh, Noah, come with me, Everest, come with me, and Wink. My three, my three wolves, my trusty wolves. We're going to bring them. Uh, and I think only them. It's just like a special birthday trip uh, between us. And I think, yes, Paige is in here with Doug. She partied a little too hard, and I think she made a new friend. Uh, hello. Oh, no, no, don't run out. Don't run out. I know you, Paige. There. Uh, I guess you can stay with Doug for now. Uh, okay. Uh, let's go into my Quonset. Do I need anything from here? I don't think so. Do I have enough pork chops? Yes, I have ten. Um, and the dog should teleport with me. Now, I'm going to be very, very careful of creepers in the Quonset. Because I do not want a repeat of my house. Hello? Coast clear? Coast clear? What have you seen, pig? Okay, I think the coast is clear, but only Everest has teleported to us. I might have sat Wink down. Uh, we are going to need some wool i'm not sure i can use blue wool if it has to be um has to be red wool i'm not sure uh and actually we're going to need to fill up a water bottle oh here are the dogs here's noah and wink uh let's grab some water from here and um oh, let's take out this uh, what are you holding a flower you're holding my buttercups get them get them guys give me those flowers back those are from the front of my house. Oh, my inventory's full. Uh, okay, there we go. Uh, okay, let's go back in here and craft what we need. We're getting a late start. We've got to go. Uh, okay, so if I craft... I need to empty some of the stuff in here. Uh, what don't I need? Don't need apples, water bottles, my door. I'll get that later. Oh, I can't believe a creeper got my house like that. Wink's throw bone. Um... Okay, I think that's good for now. Uh, okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to try doing this with blue wool. Three wool and... Yep, I've made a sleeping bag for myself. Uh, and now I'm also going to see... Do I have any cobblestone? Oh, no, I only have smooth stone. Do I really not have any cobblestone? You know what, though? This gives me a perfect opportunity to try my new uh, pickaxe. Oh, no, it doesn't because this has silk touch, and so it'll just break the smooth stone. But look at how fast this breaks it. Look at that. I think gold pickaxes are actually uh, faster than diamond pickaxes. I'm pretty sure. Uh, w just with certain blocks, and I think uh, stone is one of them. Um, but, okay, let's just get some some regular cobblestone. Uh, because we need to make a campfire base. And I think this is the recipe for that. Yep, we've got that now. Uh, and we can go ahead and put the smooth stone back. And then the last thing we need to make are uh, a tasty, tasty treat for when we are out there uh, in the woods. We are going to make some marshmallows. Uh, and if I combine, uh, if I put two iron ingots there, I get an iron stick. So if I make two more iron sticks and I put those down here, I believe this will work. Yep, I've gotten my marshmallows on a stick. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and store my marshmallows back there. Um, everything else, do I, I, I want to keep a, a light inventory. I think we're good. Guys, I think we can head out on our camping trip uh, right now. Are you guys ready? Let's do it. Come on, guys. Yes, Wink. It's time to go. Uh, I've got the perfect camping spot all picked out for us. Oh, Lizzie. I should have known you'd find your way out here. Uh, come, come, come. Let's, um, let's put you in the bark uh, just for now, and that'll be safekeeping. I don't think uh, any of the dogs in the Dalmatian Plantation or Molly or, um, or Stampy or Milktoast, they all can't get out. Um, oh, you're not unleashed. There. Nope, nope, you're not unleashed. Unleash. Lizzie, no, Lizzie. You cannot come camping with us. This was all your plan. This was your plan 
all along was to come on the camping trip. Well, we have tricked you. You are not invited. I am very sorry. Oh, that's heartbreaking. Sorry, Lizzie. Uh, but you cannot come. All right, guys, let's go to my house. Oh, my beautiful house. Uh, now, I'm actually going to go kind of slowly. Let's take a boat, guys. Uh, I'm going to go a little bit slowly because I want to make sure that the dogs keep up. I don't want any of them lagging behind. Uh, so we're going to go a little slow. This way, guys. This way. Come on. I All three of them are bobbing back there. Um, I don't think we can actually make it all the way through here on the boat. It's probably going to break. We need to widen this a little bit. <gasps> oh, guys, oh, you rocked my boat. Uh, oh, 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 no, oh. Ugh. That was totally your fault, guys. All right, we'll just do it on foot for now. Um, okay, let's go this way. And then it's actually not very far at all, which is good because we've wasted a lot of time. I thought we would get an early start in the morning. Uh, but we've gotten a fairly late start, so let's go guys. We got to make up some time <gasps> Guys look our first sign of wildlife. Do you see them? Let's approach very very carefully guys very slowly Look at these, look at the stag. Look at it, it's so majestic. Oh, we scared it. Careful, do you guys even care? You guys don't even care. Wow, hi guys. Oh, oh Wink, you like the deer? <laughs> oh, this is, uh, I think this is the perfect place to camp. Look at this, look at this uh, view. This is gorgeous. I love it. <gasps> the sun is setting. Okay, we need to hurry. Uh, let's um, let's quickly do this. Um, um, uh, 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 let's set up the tent, and um, let's put our sleeping bag inside of it. Uh, there we go. Um, let's clear some of this. Um, maybe let's uh, clear a space. <gasps> a bunny! Look at this bunny! <gasps> God, oh, careful, guys! Careful! Careful with the bunny! Oh, how cute! Look at you. I'm going to see if I can leash you and take you. <gasps> There's bunnies everywhere. They're amazing. Um, okay, this is actually a really good place to, to set up our campfire. Uh, so let's put some logs uh, down here, maybe like this, um, all around here. Do you guys like that? And then let's set down our, uh, our campfire there. And then uh, let's see if we add in a bunch of uh, coal then it turns on. Yay! Uh, so now we just need to kind of fish for some dinner, I think, uh, and then we'll have everything. And I'm gonna move the tent, I think. I think we should move the tent. I, uh, I got a little carried away thinking it was gonna be night, uh, and I, I panicked. <laughs> but I think that this is a much better uh, place over here. Uh, let's put the tent, um, I guess let's put the tent like uh, here. And then we'll put the sleeping bag uh, there. And then uh, let's put down our lantern, actually, so that it's a uh, bright around here and there's no mobs. There we go. Got some light. And now we can fish. This is so wonderful. Look at how peaceful this is. Right with, uh, with the deer and nature. Oh, I needed this vacation, guys. This is, this is pretty great. Nope, didn't catch the fish. Let me see. See if I can get one. Got it. All right, guys. Uh, so I think if we... Um, that lantern. From far away, that lantern. I really thought that that was like a fox uh, sitting down. And I would have been so excited because I love foxes. Does anyone see it? Can you kind of see it? Uh, no, it, I, I guess I just really like foxes. You guys need to stay away from the fire. Uh, oh, look, the deer are coming over. I thought that they would be scared of us, but oh, oh gosh. <laughs> uh, okay, so I think if I put down our grill kit here, yep, uh, it's made a, uh, a grill on top, and then I can put some pork chops for the dogs, and I will put a piece of fish for myself, and look, it's cooking. Yay! What do you think, Noah? You want to sit down there? Um, that, oh, that deer is scaring me. 
Um, Wink's on top of the tent. This is awesome. Here, you sit there, Wink. Everest, get out of the fire. Goodness. Uh, and then I think if I sit down like this, yep, I am sitting uh, on my campfire log. And uh, this is this is as good as it gets, guys. Um, maybe I should tell a story. Oh, wait, our food is done. Our food is done. I need to get up. Oop, I took a screenshot. Whoops. Uh, okay, let me take the food out. Uh, and then let me also try to roast the marshmallows. I don't know if I can do that. Let me see. Hmm. Let's hold them over here, maybe. <gasps> I got one! Look at that! Cooked marshmallow on a stick! I'm gonna try to eat it. Let me see if I can't. I don't know if I can eat it. Uh, it'd be... Yes! I ate it! I'm gonna try to get another one. There's nothing better than roasted marshmallows. I like to make them so that they're completely burnt. Um, ah, oh, yes, I got to eat it. That's so cool. Um, all right, guys. So how about how about a ghost story? Are you guys ready for this? Um, where's where's Everest? Okay, Everest is keeping watch, which I think is probably for the best. I'm gonna take a seat here. Uh, okay, guys. So <laughs> look at this bunny. This bunny is very, very excited about my ghost story. Uh, all right. So once upon a time, there were three wolves who decided to go camping with their owner. Uh, nope, guys. This is a make-believe story. This is not based on real events. Uh, these three wolves, they wandered far into the forest with their owner. And uh, their owner said... I'm going to go fishing. I'll be right back. And they left, uh, the owner left the wolves to set up camp. Well, hours went by and the owner didn't return. So there were these three wolves completely alone in the woods without their owner. I know, pretty scary to you guys. Um, did you guys hear something? I could have sworn I heard something. <gasps> we've got a creeper. We've got a creeper. We have got to, uh, we've got to take out this creeper uh, just so he doesn't, I just keep taking screenshots, just so he doesn't cause any trouble for us. Uh, there we go. Let's get him one more time. There we go. Uh, I didn't torch this place up, but the lantern is providing a lot of light. Uh, but I could have sworn that I heard uh, heard something. But as long as as long as we don't have any creepers, I think that that is our our biggest threat. Okay, so where was I in the story? What in the world? Oh my gosh, bear! No, 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 no! We have, we have a bear! We have a bear! What in the world? Um, oh, protect me, guys! Protect me! He's eating. He's on. The bear's on fire. Wink is killing the bear. Everest is bloody. The <gasps> Everest! Everest killed the bear! Wink! Everest! You guys! Oh my gosh! Oh! That was insane! I did not know that there were bears! Uh, I am very, very scared all of a sudden. I think that we should go to bed, guys. Um, this is... This is... Oh, Everest! Poor Everest! Here, let me see if I can give you the, the cooked pork chops uh, to help your health. There you go. Oh! Uh, I think that's enough ghost stories for tonight. Um, we're gonna probably go off to sleep in our, our sleeping bag and, um, and hope that no other bears come to kill us. Uh, and then in the morning, I think we're just gonna go home and, and try to get a vet for, for Everest. Um, poor Everest. I really thought that Wink would be the one to, to leap to my defense, but I should have known Everest is the bravest of the dogs. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Uh, a big thank you to Everest for uh, for making it so that we didn't die, because that would have been a bummer. Uh, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Paige and Molly love you. Go rescue a dog.